This is the reason why I call myself Mad Dogs and an Englishman. Brace yourself. So, the wood in question is that one over there. It's not massive, it's only a small wood. But um, I always seem to see something in there or around it. All right. All right, so I've got this. I've got this mad thing, okay? It's on sports mode. I'm going to take it back and take you up. Now, this is a DJI flip. We're shooting at 4K, 60 frames per second. I'm going to flick you around. And I'm going to head off in this direction over towards uh, the wood. Uh, we're just going to have a little bit of a, a hunt around just to really see what we can see. I'll just get a bit of height. Not a massive wood, but I tell you what, there's quite a lot in there. Yeah. Right, gives you a bit of an idea. Give you a bit of a, a sideways swipe and a bit of a yaw at the same time. Okay, so that's what we're kind of looking at. So, geographically, uh, this place is on the north and east side of Swindon. All right, we're just gonna go it sideways. I'll be a bit careful here, I don't run into a tree or something, so I'm not gonna do that for too long. Okay, right, let's head it back towards the home point where I am. somewhere I think okay. there we go and here she comes and here she comes there we go right safely back in my possession gonna get myself over there and um, stick the Neo up or down fire it in and see if we can actually see something I might have to change the props around I think just to see I don't know okay I have swapped them all around pretty much turn it back on um, so basically I've just changed everything over uh, so I don't know whether this is uh, actually going to work uh, let's find out actually flew off then <laughs> oh gosh okay let's try tightening it up let's try tightening it up then shall we uh, before we actually try and um, fly off again that's probably a, a good thing to do I thought I did you know I thought that was absolutely murder tight okay well we'll just um oh my gosh this has turned out to be a bit of a a disaster guys isn't it you know me um, I'm pretty much true to myself and to you guys out there we can all learn from this I think just make sure that they're all down absolutely tight as you like well they are so we'll try that a ah, we'll try that again oh my goodness me never seen that before lucky I found it actually okay I haven't got the tops on by the way, I left them at home. I took them off because I, you get a little bit more flight time apparently. Okay, here we go. Bar, follow, three, two, one. There we go. Sorted. Welcome back. I must have I must have taken them off at some point to clean it or whatever else, but it seems to be working fine now. Anyway, we're gonna dive in here. I'm just gonna grab my gear. Oh, kind of got it back. Amazing. Right. 
So this wood then, eh? This wood. Nice place. Nice wood, this one. Um, it, it never, well, I say never fails me. Normally, I see something in here. Normally I do. Uh, but now I've kind of give it the kiss of death. I probably won't see anything at all. I wonder what happens uh, if you turn on the RC unit with it all connected up. I wonder how it would react uh, with the drone. Let's find out, shall we? This could be interesting, a little experiment. Okay, right, everything's good now. All good. Uh, so it's going to be it's rather busy in here, guys, okay? What I call rather busy, it means that there's a lot of uh, stuff going on uh, regarding twigs and whatever else. I really have got to be on my very best flying ability to keep this thing in a fairly flyable state. Um, just really, just, oh, some deer, I think. So you may have seen some deer then. I don't know what that was. Something definitely jumped, jumped over or jumped by. I don't quite know where it went, mine, but I'll take over the other side of the wood. And we'll just see what we can see. I definitely saw something then. I don't know what it was. I think I've got an idea that might have been deer, if not some uh, yetis. <laughs> the lesser spotted Great British Yeti. Right, we're all going into the sun there. I don't really want to be going into the sun. Anyway, just nice to be out here once again. I mean, I was coming out with the dogs anyway, so I just thought, well, why not just grab your drone and um, do some drone flying, eh? You know, what a fantastic hobby it is. Why not, I thought. Why not, indeed? Oh, here we go. I thought I saw something, you know. I'm not going to uh, pursue it for long. I just want to... Okay, I, I tell you, this place never, it never, you know, it, it always delivers, this place. It's a great little wood. It really is. I mean, it's a damn tough place to fly in. You really do need to, um, to be on your best flying metal to actually get through fairly unscathed. But it's great just for really just sharpening up your drone flying skills as you're flying into the sun you can't see an awful lot anyway we saw something i tell you it always delivers this place it never fails it never fails to surprise me that's always something in here for a small little wood i mean it's a nothing sort of a place but there's always something to see can i get under there do you reckon oh, i'm just glitching up slightly just about oh just scraped i think the top of the drone. Right, now I'm glitching up badly but I've got the sun on my back so therefore it should be a little bit easier to fly when it's not glitching up so much. Just take off in this direction. Okay. Okay. Oh, bloody hell. Jeepers, that made me jump. Oh, bloody hell. That's one of them crow bangers, isn't it? That time of year again. It's literally just a, maybe a hundred metres away or something. Oh dear. Oh, I'm on my back. Oh, I don't know. I might be able to take off from there. Let's give it a go, shall we? It might go. It might go. No, I think the motors are stuck. Okay, right. Not a big impact. We're going to go and grab it. There he is. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah, always okay. I mean, it's an absolute warrior, isn't it? Yeah, great drone. Found it. No problems at all. She will fly again. 
it's um let's take it out of the wood I can have a look around away oh, oh, away we go flying by the seat of our pants try to keep it in a fairly straight line if I can just find a gap somewhere um, gosh it's really busy isn't it just Oh, it's caught on something, it's doing something funky. Okay, I'll just try and get through there. Just try and find a... There we go, got through. Right. Let's have a little fly around, shall we, out here. And we're just going to take it up and away. Uh, so this is 1080p, 60 frames per second, shooting at 4.3 aspect ratio. Um, you can see the picture quality is pretty good. I mean, I'm happy with that. I mean, uh, you look in the in the background there. You can, I mean, you've got um, good clarity uh, of picture. Swing it over towards the west. Max altitude reached. Okay. Um, we'll bring it back down again then. And if I'm able to, I'm going to uh, bring it into the wood. Don't do it. just pixelating up slightly, just losing signal. I just want to try and bring it into the wood if I can from this direction. Oh, we'll give it a go. Let's see what we can do, eh? If I can just get down a little bit. Go on, get down, get down. Okay, all right. We can perhaps we can just get in, try and get it back towards my home point. Right, it's really going to be tough flying conditions back here, guys, but my saving grace is I, I've got the sun on my back so I can see what's ahead of me quite well. Um, just looking for a little gap there just to see if I can manoeuvre through using every bit of my skill set to do this. Still on sports mode, by the way. Oh, he just went past me, I think. Right, I'm going to take it back. Put on normal mode. And here we go. There's a weird-looking chap in the woods there who's looks very much like me, flying his drone. Okay. All right. There we go. Sorted. Yes, very good. Very interesting. Nice little wood. It's amazing, really, what you can see in a small wood like this. Like, I've been flying in Savanac past several visits, not seen a thing. You come here, within five minutes, you see deer. I'm not sure where they've gone, mine, but, um, yeah. Let's uh, have a little fly over here, shall we? Let's go kamikaze style, shall we? And See if we can just fly it through this lot. Oh, look at it. Can I navigate my way through here, I wonder? Uh, so anyway, just pretend, okay, that somewhere in the wood there is lesser spotted great British yetis and also there's a puma. A big black puma is on the loose and we've got to flush them out because uh, Swindon police have had a report um, of a, a a black puma and a lesser spotted great British Yeti has been harassing the tourists and uh, it is my job to uh, to find out where he is tell the authorities and they will come out and they will do what they need to do with the Yeti or with the puma okay so there we go so there we go I'm 50 pounds an hour not bad eh it's good good I, I wish I wish I was by the way would be nice wouldn't it and he's got himself a new day job flying around forests in the UK looking for lesser spotted great British yetis and black panthers <laughs> there we go I wonder if there's any jobs like that there must be some jobs somewhere okay so there must be some weird looking stuff in the woods like aliens or something 
Yes, and he's been um, he's been he's been consigned. Is that the right word? I don't know. He's got a contract with the British government to uh, to search out alien bases deep in the woods in forests in the UK. That's my job, okay? And um, I'm I'm on reconnaissance at the moment. And uh, we're trying to find uh, panthers and aliens and lesser spotted great British yetis. And uh, at the moment, all I found is some deer, which is pretty damn good to be honest. I'm quite happy with that. Anyway, we're just gliding through the wood just to see if we can see some yetis or some black panthers or even some, uh, some, some aliens or something. Yeah. Okay. Right. Um, yeah. So I think the dogs have had a good walk. Um, I've had I've had my fix for a day. I think I'm going to take this thing back in the home homeward point, and I'm going to go home, make some dinner, and um, yeah, make a video, I suppose. Try and make sense of this stuff. Try and make sense of the madness. Anything over here, I wonder? Any any uh, any aliens or panthers or yetis lurking around here anywhere, I wonder? Oh, it's getting busy. It's getting busy. I can't think I can get through there. Gosh, it's like wild wool, isn't it? Oh, oh. Gosh, wow. Right, okay. Right, one last belt around, and then I think we can probably call that a wrap. I've had my fix for the day. Battery I've had... level is low. I've been out. I've... Aircraft will return to the home point in ten seconds. Okay, I've been outside. I've had my. I've low had my... battery. Return to home promptly. I've had my fix. I've had my fix. Okay, right. Home point is. I think in this direction. Yep. Yeah, okay. There we go. Right, can I get to the home point without it sort of start bleeping at me? That's my mission. No, I can't. I lost. Damn. We try our best though. Try and duck and dive and dodge and weave. Get our way through this mad crazy place. And here we go. We there we go. Job done. Here we go, guys. Hope you enjoyed that. I've had an absolute blast. I love the place. Love it.